Okay, so in this video, I'm sorry I'm a sweaty mess. I just finished working out. Tiger Lilies! What's poppin'? 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 What's Hey, hey. Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl. Essence of Shayskies. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let's pause the video right now and click that subscribe button. If you haven't already, click those notification bells if you haven't already. Without further ado, today's daily affirmation is shit happens. Deal with it. This is the truth, y'all. Repeat after me. Shit happens. Deal with it. Don't run from it, deal with it. We act as though life is supposed to be peaches and cream. We go through life thinking that everything should be copacetic, everything should be 100%, everything should be A-OK. -okay. So when things happen, we crumble up in a ball, we don't know how to act, we don't know how to behave. And we just have to understand that shit happens without further ado let's get right into the video okay so in this video i'm sorry i'm a sweaty mess i just finished working out but you see in the beginning of the video i went to jenny's beauty supply store that's a big um hair supply store in the dallas area i don't know if it's Dallas or it's called Oak Cliff or Red Girl, I don't know. Um, but I spent a grand total of $9.71. I don't think y'all could see that. And this is what I bought. I went and got me some clips uh, because I wanted to try clips again. I haven't used clips in a long time to retwist my hair. So I wanted to use these. This is an 80 pack of single prong clips. This was a whopping, damn, Craig. This was $5.99. What? Damn. I'm low-key mad about that. And then I went and got some edge control. This is Edge Effect Professional Edge Control Gel. Whole level is a five. It smells like, I opened it yesterday. It smells like passion fruit or peaches or something. But I wanted to try a new edge control because you guys know I'm in a seek, seeks. I'm seeking out edge control for my edges. And then I went and bought an, um, an Old Faithful. Oh, that was $1.99, this little bottle. Um, I bought an Old Faithful that I used to use all the time in the beginning of my, uh, after I stopped using beeswax, I used to use this all the time to twist my hair and this has coconut oil, glycinerin, um, some other words that I don't know. But I know it never used to leave my hair flaky. And it's from the ORSS or ORS brand. And it is, but this is a lock and twist gel. Um, I love this stuff. And this stuff was, this is a 13 ounce bottle. Uh, and this stuff was actually, wait a minute, this was $3.99, the regular price, but the promote use, I just saved $3, so it was $0.99. Cents. 99 cents for this huge jug me understand and this clip thing here was $5.99 how is this more than a gel what do you ask if you are in the texas area or you're close to the dallas area 
go to Jenny's. It's a huge, I you saw the clip, you haven't figured it out. This is another retwist video. Um, yeah, because I needed to retwist my, you see, I'm going to show y'all. So last time I twisted it, it was two weeks ago, and I did it here, and I used that Cantu stuff, right? So this is my hair now. I don't know if how it looks in the back there. So I saw in the last video, a lot of you guys said that when you retwist your hair, you start from the back. So it's not just me. So that's cool. Um, yo, I still got soap in my hair. I will be back. Damn it. All right. <laughs> so let's start that again. So now I'm just going to seal in the moisture with my Covet oil. If you guys haven't bought it already, please go on my site, www.essenceofshade.com and purchase you your bottle, purchase you the set, the full size set, or purchase you the travel size. And if you have purchased it before, please leave me your reviews of the products because I wanna know like what I can improve on, what do you like about the product, all that jazz. So somebody asked me in a comment box, how has life been in Dallas? Um, I did a video about this, but I'll talk about it again. Life in Dallas has been all right. As you guys know, I did lose my job and I, I have given myself 30 days to just work on my brand and see what happens. And then after the 30 days, if there, I don't expect there to be a drastic improvement, but I expect to still have um, some sort of money coming in so that I'm able to pay for my rent, right? Because nobody's gonna pay for that. Um, so if after 30 days, Nothing like that is even close to happening. I will go back into the job market. I'm just deciding now if I'm gonna go and get a full-time job again, or am I gonna go get a part-time? Because um, doing this and working every day on my business and on my brand, and just like researching and doing all that stuff, I, knew that I enjoyed it before but I actually really I'm really in love with it and I really want to do this full-time and I want to incorporate um, like public speaking because I have a lot of stuff that I want to share right I always do this one, because it helps seal in the moisture in my hair. Two, it helps um, the oils penetrate my locks more and my scalp. Three, it helps with the frizzies. Four, I work out majority of the time at home and I'm my apartment is full of carpet. So a lot of times you could imagine that carpet stuff goes inside my hair. Y'all. Look how like thick my hair is getting again. There's still some thin parts. All right, so um, moving to Dallas is pretty chill. I had a few hiccups as far as like in the beginning. I had a, I got a job as soon as I moved here, which was awesome, um, but it wasn't paying me as much as I was getting paid at my hotel job in Brooklyn. So I had to like, uh, I didn't adjust my finances accordingly because I still had the same amount of bills even though, um, sorry, even though um, I, was, I let go of my car and I didn't have the car insurance anymore. I still had bills, but I didn't, so my my advice would be like just to like write when you're moving 
just write down like all your bills moving in and then be oh, how can i say sorry write all your bills that you have before that you're gonna you had before you moved there and then write your bills that you have coming here so then put them all together so you know what to budget for and what your monthly um spending is going to be as far as bills go because i didn't do that Yo, these clips is gonna take forever i feel like sorry if my head is down while i'm talking to you guys because i'm twisting the back of my head my face is darker than the rest of my body because um after i gained all that weight hi yay yay after i gained all that weight i didn't really want to show like my legs and stuff so i i'll be so friggin hot in the summertime but i'll be wearing like black jeans and stuff because i just didn't want to show the rest of my body um so then my i did start doing that for years and now the rest of my body is way lighter than my face all right y'all so this is half of my hair done half done still got the rest i have a lot of hair fam let me take a thumbnail picture right now also if you guys didn't know i have a i'm me self-love um course or a video chat the first call is free we just talk about what you expect from the call what i'm about how i got to the position that i am in now as far as i really truly like loving myself and understanding who i am and understanding the importance of me so um i will put a link of that in the description below and then once we talk if you think that i can further help you into just loving you and just like not running away from your problems and embracing it and putting yourself first if after that conversation you think that i can help you then we move on to the 45 minute video chat where i go into a little bit more in depth I do a bit of a cleansing with you in the beginning we say an affirmation for you for that week and then we go into the nitty-gritty and that is sixty dollars but before we get to that we'll have a free conversation for about 30 minutes and we'll just get to know each other a little bit um so if you guys are interested in something like that please check the description box below these clips are annoying it's like you have to clip them to something else for it's just it's too much linda my hands hurt guys i don't want to do it anymore i hate twisting my hair yo you guys i think i'm ready to start dating again like before i was just having like fun with people hang out vibe nothing too dramatic but i think i'm actually ready to start dating nobody said anything about a relationship just actually like dating i i've been on the tinder app i've been on the bumble app apps are not for me <laughs> you waiting for the person to respond or waiting for the person to message you or all sometimes all that person want is just sex and it's like okay especially if they keep talking about your lips and that's why i want anything else but your lips fam get out of here boy book i had there's someone that my friends already think that i'm dating but maybe we are but we haven't had that conversation we keep calling each other friends but we're acting as though i don't know I've been out of this for a while, so. Ah. What? You gotta separate it. Come on. Y'all know this. <sighs> I tell you one thing. My arms are tired. Do you guys retwist your own hair or you get it done professionally? And if you get, do retwist your own hair, hair, do you enjoy it? Because I do not. Like, my back is hurting. 
Should your back be hurting when you were twisting your hair, son? Like, I don't like doing... Oh. One would think that 60 locks is not enough, but it is. <laughs> I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> I'm over it. All right, y'all, so this is the finished product. I'm gonna go in the dryer. I laid my edges a little bit with this. Nothing too crazy. I tried to do a design there. I don't know what the heck that is. I don't, I, so I'm gonna go under the dryer, let it dry a little bit, um, and then I'll be back to tell you my final, my final prognosis and my final look, honeys. To the lube, to butt butt. Your girl is back. <laughs> this is my hair. I already know that that twisting gel would be good because that's an old faithful. Like I said, I used it in uh the first couple years after I learned to stop using uh, beeswax in my hair, I used that for a while. So, um, yeah, I actually really like that. I don't know why I stopped, but it's always good to go back to things that you did in the beginning um, before you started doing all kind of extra stuff to your hair. So the key of this video, go back. Learn from the past, sis. Learn from the past. Also, that edge control... Look how I got, um, that's a zit. Don't worry about that. But look how I got, like, my edges all laid, sis. Look, look at that. She nice and laid and fried and what kind of thing on thing. I like it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so much. See you later, Tiger Lilies. Too old. Crash course. Let me hide the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the curb.